Hey everybody, it's Emerald, and today I'm going to be showing you alternative ways to play games on your Chromebook. So, first thing you're going to want to do is you're going to have two options here that I'm presenting. Amazon Luna and Xbox Cloud Gaming, and both of these will allow you to play um, games on your school Chromebook, like actual games. So, we'll start off with the Xbox Cloud Gaming. So, this Xbox Cloud Gaming has many many games that's a big upside is the sheer amount of games it has the list just goes on and on and on now some of the downsides of this are one that it's paid now both of these are paid Amazon Luna and Xbox Cloud Gaming but the good thing about Xbox Cloud Gaming is when you buy Game Pass which allows you to use Cloud Gaming on your Chromebook you can also use the Game Pass on your Xbox and so, like, um, just a random game here. I'll click on, like, say, Ashtonier. And, well, I got to sign in first. And the first thing you're going to have to do when you get to this website is sign in. So it's going to ask you to sign in with your um, Microsoft account. And once you do all that, it will get you signed in and everything. And you'll go be back to the Xbox game. Play. And then once you hit play takes a minute it will say well I don't have my controller connected right now but you can easily connect your controller by going into Bluetooth and pairing your Xbox wireless controller by hitting the small circular button with the three lines next to it on the top of your controller by pressing and holding that once your controller light starts blinking you'll want to go into your Bluetooth here and connect to it and browser always says unsupported but no matter what, even though it says unsupported, it will still work. And so you'll hit like launch and it might take, I don't know, anywhere from I've seen 30 seconds to a minute, actually down to like 10 seconds. But um, it will load in, as you can see, it will sync all your data from, say, your Xbox. So you have all the same same data and it will load in. And the good thing about this is it's really, really fast to get in as well. Um, depending on the game. I mean, some games just naturally take longer no matter what device you're on. So that's our first option there. Our second option is cloud gaming with Amazon Luna. And Luna is nice because it gives you a few different choices on what types of games you want and how you want to pay for them. And so if you go into Luna here, you'll load in. And once you go to Amazon.com slash Luna, It'll suggest you, it'll say, um, get access, and you'll have to sign into your Amazon account. And then it'll bring up three different things. I think one's Ubisoft Plus, one's like a family plan with a bunch of family games, which, I mean, I'm sure most of you guys don't want to play. And then another one's just Luna, which has a few good games like Resident Evil. Um, but I believe the best one is um, Ubisoft, just because it has a lot of new games. So you can even play Far Cry 6 or Assassin's Creed um, Valhalla on your school Chromebook, which is what I was actually doing at school. And remember to get, at least my school doesn't block the Amazon.com at school. You don't need any of the unblockers from that, but it just depends on your school settings. Now I know Xbox.com, in order to go to your school, you have to have your um, VPN that I showed you how in previous videos, how to get on there, and you have to have securely disabled like I showed you in the previous videos. So I bet the reason why the Amazon isn't loading right now is because I have the securely disabled right now. And honestly, if your securely is blocking Amazon, I don't think there's a way that you can really get past that because it's kind of loading. There might be by going into settings and turning it off while you're trying to load in. So, I'll probably just get this part, but if I don't, oh well. So just turning off the unblocks. And remember, when you turn these off, Xbox, next time you try to load it, it won't work. But yeah, once you get in, there'll be a few different games that you can play. And it's kind of nice. So these are two very, very, very good options that you can use to game on your Chromebook. So yeah, if you guys liked the video, make sure to like and subscribe. And I'll see you all in the next one. See ya for now.